Hey, what's up guys? On today's video, I'm gonna be doing a quick install. I have a quick lunch break. I have some basic tools. I'm gonna go ahead and install a Molly panel for my armrest here. I'm gonna be working with Fistaprint. They are a company that I found on Etsy. I love supporting small business. I'm a small business owner myself, so I'm gonna give the product a try. So far, what I've received, I love. So let's go ahead and take a look. So they sent me two styles here. Let's go ahead and open these guys up. I chose yellow because I have a lot of yellow accents around my vehicle. I love the way that this one pops. And I'm really excited about this one, which is the full version. Here you go. This is the half version and this is the full version. These are 3D printed. They're very strong. I'm gonna go ahead and attempt to install this. So. It did include some basic instructions. Um, let's go ahead and start by removing this. So, okay, there goes the tissue box. Okay, so the removal of six screws. So there's gonna be two on the top. I'm gonna put this in my cup holder. Four on the bottom. So the next is to get a pry tool to separate the uh, top armrest cover from the inside lid. I don't have a panel popper with me right now, so I'm gonna use a flathead. I'm gonna try to be careful, dig a little bit before I commit. There are four clips on the side, mm -hmm. and then there's gonna be two more on the top. So let's feel for those clips. There you go. There you go. The sides are released, and then there's gonna be two up top. There you go. This comes right off. This is what you work with. So the instruction says to remove the screws and we're gonna pretty much place them down like this. So these are a set of Allen keys. So now that I have all the screws removed, and then you're gonna use this back piece as a template. It's gonna go like that. And it does include this bit of a nail here. This is used to make a slight impression onto this piece so that I can drill it in. I'm gonna align everything, making sure everything's straight. And I'm gonna use some body weight and create an impression. So what that does is it creates a little dimple so that I can pre-drill the holes and uh, everything will line up. So just don't press too hard, but you do need to put some pressure into it. All right, so now that I have the molly panel aligned here and I have the dimples made underneath, I'm gonna get ready to drill the hole through. A um, Couple things that you wanna keep in mind is not to use the template and drill on top of the drill spot. Um, they recommend that you remove this so that it doesn't damage anything. Um, another thing is, so what you're actually doing is you're drilling a hole through there. There is a little nut that is pre-done inside here, which is really nice. It'll hold the nut in place. And you're gonna go ahead and drill from the bottom and it's going to attach and create that firm, tight grip. So let's go ahead and uh, drill some holes. Six points, one, two, three, four, five, six. And keep in mind, there's a couple of long screws for these top ones, and then there's short screws for these. So let's go ahead and uh, start with one side. Make sure you guys don't over tighten. So the last two, there's some tabs right here. You just need to cut them off. 
use one of these knives. Now I've begun to screw down the molly panels. I've inserted the screws all six sides here and I'm gonna go ahead and tighten them. Not too tighten, but making sure that it's tight. Let's go ahead and uh, install this guy back on here. I'm gonna start with the top. I'm gonna grab the screws back from the cup holder. Then there's gonna be four screws on the bottom. There you go. Now I'm gonna go ahead and add some accessories to this. All right guys, there you go. Simple install. I did it during my lunch break. It was hot. I got minimal tools, but I'm still able to get this done. And it's pretty neat what it can do. So let's go ahead and take a look. I just added a couple of things right now. I didn't have time to reorganize this uh, to be fully, fully efficient. But so far I have my multi-tool here, flashlight, and some multi multiple accessory bag right here. So um, I like it very much so far. It still closes very nicely with my setup. I, I do have a wireless charger here, which I'll go into depth on another video on. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Um, I'll drop a link below on the Etsy store where I got this from. Support them, they're a, they're a nice small business. So always support your local business. They, have, they make a great product. I'll look forward to using more of their products. I'm gonna give them a great feedback on this. Again, thanks for watching. Thanks for catching up with me and I'll catch you guys on the next one.